Hey everyone, this is Tommy Cannon, and I'm here to let you know how I currently make a page of the Fred the Mustard Packet comic. So here is how I made a page for Fred that's going to appear in a future issue of Comics Never Stop. So it's not going to be on the normal oh, Fred website or Webtoons, it's going to be in Comics Never Stop. So here's how I do it, and I do this for Webtoons as well, uh, just at a different size. So it starts with a notebook page. I just thought of the word coffee, and it grew from there. So I made an idea, and I put it in a little notepad. And then what I do is I open up a program called Graphic. It is a graphic design program that works in vector art. In that program, I lay out the words and the panels. That's right, I do the lettering first, just like they did for the old 1950s horror and science fiction EC comics. So, you know, the kinds that Wally Wood and Joe Orlando and Jack Davis worked on. So I kind of work around the lettering. And the notebook gives me a slight idea of where that will go. I then pencil the image, kind of loose, kind of light, so that way it erases easily. And I go ahead and ink the balloons around the words. Uh, once I do that, then I erase the lines, and then I kind of touch up my line work. Uh, that's where I kind of add heavier lines, where I want to put emphasis. If I want to do any hatching, I do it there. I then scanned it into the computer, and in this is instance, since it's going to comics never stop, they have bigger pages. So I scanned it at 600 DPI. Normally, you want to do 300 DPI, but I scanned it so that way it could be twice as big and still appear crisp and clean. So um, that's how I did it, and, uh, you know, I put it into graphics, I lay out the panels, and I print it out that way, and I draw it right in there. So that's how I do it, and then I scan it in again so I can email it to people or add color. Thanks for checking it out. Bye.